Hi, we're going to be making today a roasted rack of venison with gooseberries that comes every year. And uh, I find them very unique. Uh, we are going to incorporate that with a port wine reduction. We're going to start with our venison. I have my pan hot, olive oil, and we are going to sear the venison. Try to sear on both sides. I'm looking for a nice, beautiful caramelized color. We're going to flip it over. And we are going to keep going, finish on the oven. I'm going to serve this dish with spaghetti squash and the sweet potato puree. The spaghetti squash has been has been cooked in the oven. You're going just to finish with the shallot, the honey and the butter, and salt and pepper. While this is cooking, we are going to finish our sweet potato puree. Very creamy. Let's take a look at our, our uh, venison. I think we're going to flip one more time. It's looking very good. Looking terrific. We are going to finish with our port reduction and our gooseberries. One thing I have to say about, uh, about uh, gooseberries is uh, I find it a very unique fruit. I try to keep it exactly as it is without changing it much. So we are going to warm it up, some of those in my sauce, and I'm going to use uh, two of them to garnish the dish. And to finish the dish, let me show you how we how we'll present it. We are going to start with our sweet potato puree. Goes right in the center of the dish. Followed by uh, the butternut squash. I like to garnish the butternut squash with uh, those uh, the little unique uh, gooseberries. My rack of venison is ready. At the end, I'm going to baste it with thyme, shallot, and butter. As the butter starts melting, we are going to baste the rack of venison with the thyme and the shallots. Looks fantastic. We are finishing rack of venison and uh, the gooseberry port wine reduction. This is one of the dishes in our window menu. Enjoy it. <laughs> 